Hey guys, welcome to the video. We're gonna do a quick unboxing and review of our Razer Death Adder V2 wired gaming mouse. We've heard some really good things about this mouse and we're really excited to add it to our setup. We've had the mouse for about six months now and we're doing a long-term review. I'll play some footage of us unboxing it, just showing what comes in the box. And uh, a bit later, we'll get into some more detail about what we think of the mouse. So just some background on our setup. We use a bit of a strange setup compared to most people probably. We have a 2022 MacBook Pro and we use an external Samsung 34 inch ultra wide curved monitor. We also run the Razer keyboard and mouse now with our Razer headphones. Our setup works really well. Um, we team this up with the Stream Deck when we're editing videos or if we're streaming as well. Opening up the box, We've got all your basic items in there included, everything you need to get running. We've got a little note from Razer. We've got our instruction manual. We've got some stickers as well, which is cool. Let's get the mouse out and have a look. This mouse is super versatile. It does a ton of stuff and it's got some really good features. This mouse is really nice to use. It's really light coming in at just 82 grams. It's very easy to move around and it does slide really nicely on those feet. The feet are 100% PTFE mouse feet. You can tell straight away because the movement across any surface is really, really smooth. And they do quote that, that it's made from the purest, highest grade of PTFE, which is basically a material they use for non-stick pans. This mouse comes with eight programmable buttons that are fully configurable using Razer's Synapse 3 program, giving you access to macros, secondary functions, uh, and basically every action that can be executed. So that's something that attracted us to this mouse, given that it's so versatile. The finish on the mouse is not bad. It's actually a really light mouse. We've run a few different mice before, and this one definitely is by far one of the best we've used so far. I'll go over some of the specs a little bit later in the video, but we'll have a close look at the mouse now. The scroll wheel is absolutely amazing on this mouse. Cycling through different weapons and bunny hops is really just uh, very smooth and easy. It's got a really good feel. It's very smooth, it's not too hard to push and it does have a nice clicking motion as well. The cord on this mouse is actually really soft and it moves around really easily, which is great. The cable is made from Razer's Speedflex material. The Razer Death Adder V2's cable has greater flexibility and it's designed to produce minimal drag so that you can perform quicker, more fluent swipes. So that's really good. Overall, using the mouse is really comfortable and ergonomic. The mouse makes it easy to use with its five onboard memory profiles, so you can program different settings to different buttons for different games. And it does have that 20K optical sensor, which is pretty uh, industry leading as well. So that's a bonus. Thanks for watching guys, I really appreciate it. Nothing too technical in this video, just a basic unboxing and giving you my thoughts on the mouse. If you do like what you saw, please feel free to give us a like on the video, that really does help us. And if you'd like to subscribe to us to stay up to date for future videos as well. Thank you.